Hi, and welcome back to Two Minutes with the VA. Our next question is from Beth. Um, Beth wants to know what the difference between Quicken, Peachtree, and QuickBooks are, and how does she know what to use? Um, okay, Beth. <laughs> okay, uh, QuickBooks is, is generally what most people are using. That's for small, most small and medium, small businesses use a lot of Quick. QuickBooks. Um, Quicken is mainly for personal and I would say hobby businesses. Um, for instance, if you uh, make and design purses on Etsy, uh, Quicken may be enough for you. Um, you know, I wouldn't use Quicken for, for very much business stuff, in my own opinion. Um, I think Quicken is more uh, designed for, um, you know, like I said, personal and very small business, hobby businesses. Uh, Peachtree is Similar to QuickBooks, um, it's not as user friendly. I, I don't necessarily agree with that, but the general consensus is that it's not as user friendly. Um, and you'll also find whenever you're looking for a CPA or looking for a bookkeeper, which you may not be right now, but you may later, um, a lot of them don't even have Peachtree or have a Peachtree experience. Um, I have only met one CPA in my 10 years of being in business that did not have QuickBooks. Um, and it was kind of shocking, actually. Uh, but, you know, most people do have it. So that's, you know, that's something to think about. As far as how do you know what to use, I'm assuming you have a small VA business. Um, and I would tell you, use QuickBooks. Uh, just, you know, just go for it. Uh, you probably want to go with the pro version. Uh, that's usually what I tell people just to start with. Don't even bother with the simple start or whatever they're calling it now. Uh, just go straight to the pro version. Uh, now is a good time to buy because um, 2012 has been out for a little while. If you can find 2011, you can usually find a good price on it. Um, so I would check that out as well. And I'll link to both versions at Amazon down here for you so you can, um, you know, look at them yourself. A lot of people are starting to use FreshBooks. I think FreshBooks is absolutely wonderful for an invoicing platform, um, but it's nothing you can't do with inside of QuickBooks with billing solutions. And I don't really like FreshBooks. Um, I haven't seen it in about a year, but I did not like FreshBooks the way they handled some of the expenses and all. It's not a true accounting uh, system, um, but I'm heavy on reports. And, and you may not be now, but you may in the future. And um, I always tell people, you know, think about the future and what you want to do with your accounting. Because uh, you can change it year-end, but it's always best to start that back on, on the right foot. Okay, I uh, will be quiet about that. That's my opinion. <laughs> Talk to you.